Well, I didn't know if we made a move side to side, but it it looked like we didn't get very many second shots. I mean, you can have a hundred perimeter shots, and it looks good on the stat board, but if you're not um, if they're not taking penalties, cross checking you in the back and and tripping you in front of the net, that means you're not fighting to get through there. How much of a different uh, paint job goes on this game if they call that instigator and if they see the uh, high sticks, the two high sticks on Shimera? Well, obviously it makes a difference, but I mean, if I start talking about that again, then I'm whining about referees, and I, I don't want to use that as an excuse. How much of a that good, or did you go? Or did you just lament not taking enough good shots at him? I mean, he made some good saves. I'm not denying that, and he, you know, and he feels very comfortable, obviously, playing us. He shut us out the last game, but um, I don't think it was uh, it was one of those games where he had to make a tremendous amount of second saves on the same play, and that's that's what scores goals. If you look at what, what the way they were playing is is the they might not have had the quality chances, but when they do, they have three guys going to the net, and it's bang, 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 and and you have to be ready to, you know, to make the play. So. How deflating was Atlanta's third goal? Just because after Alex's, it seemed like everybody came out of the, came into the third, charged up. It was a deflating goal. I think we lost our focus. I mean, um, you know, I mean, from the fact that they were still talking about the the supposed penalty. Uh, on the bench, and then the next thing you know, the the goal's in the net. Can you talk about uh, the lack of second chances. Is that for lack of effort, or is it for kind of lack of positioning? I think it's, um, I mean, you, you look at our team, we haven't scored a lot of goals lately. I think it's the lack of commitment to paying the price to score. We're all wanting to score, but we're pay staying on the perimeter, hoping to get the puck, rather than the being the guy that's going to the puck, uh, get the puck. And the guys that did that had chances, but they're not natural goal scorers. And you know, I mean, Hendricks went to the net. There was a loose puck there, and it bounced over his stick. Um, you know, I mean, Eric Fair, who's you know holding the stick too tight, went to the net. He flipped up on him. Um, but I mean. It, and, and the same thing with a couple like the Knubel had had things in there, but the guys that are looking to score are not getting their their nose dirty enough to score the goals. Is that happening on the power play and even strength? Well, I think tonight it happened on the power play. I thought our, our I mean, if you look at the power play, we'd have everybody just all in a circle looking to take one timers, uh, and uh, then there was no there was no second shot capability. So usually when we've got the puck at the point. I mean, we have a guy going to the net, but we have options. Tonight I was looking, they are getting the puck at the point or on the half wall, and everybody was just standing around hoping something was going to happen.